here from Citrus Heights, California. Two little ones at home. So you're taking a little bit of a mommy detox mommy time. Detox. Yeah, I'm taking a break from the noise and the food covered clothes and <laughs> and missing my girls desperately. Yeah, but we're glad to have you in the hot seat because you're just 15 questions away from the million dollars. Take a look at the categories. I know that you know the rules and the lifelines. You ready to play? I'm ready as I'll ever be. <laughs> All right, then, let's play. Fifteen seconds on the clock, Ruth. Patriotic songs, nice way to start. Country star Lee Greenwood's most famous song is the patriotic ditty, God Bless the What? Netherlands, USA, Philippines, Olive Garden. <laughs> B, USA, final answer. God Bless the USA. Too much texting, but text me. The text message form of a common idiom, O T O H, stands for on the other what? Horse, honey, hand, home. C, hand, final answer. On the other hand. There's the 300. Improvement in hoisting apparatus was an 1861 patent that dramatically improved the safety of what modern invention? Radio, elevator, telephone, camera. B, elevator, final answer. Hoist stuff up, yes. So close yet so far. Though they're fairly close together, Tonga and Samoa are 24 hours apart because they lie on opposite sides of the what? International Dateline, Equator, Prime Meridian, Tropic of Cancer. A, International Dateline, final answer. You knew that one right away. Good job. For $1,000, Ruth. Aggies, Emmys, Shooters, and Taws are all objects used in what children's game? Hopscotch, Foursquare, Kickball, Marbles. D, Marbles, final answer. You got $2,000, Ruth. She came from California to make a million, and she's on her way. We'll be back. You brought your sisters with you. Sarah and Katie are in the audience. Nice to see What a gorgeous family. Nice to see you guys. Beautiful family. You came here. Have a little time away from the, from the kids and your husband. A little mommy detox time. But I know that you are missing them very much. I am. I, I love my little girls. And so I had them record a little something for me on my phone so I could hear their voices. Uh, well, you know, your husband, I don't know if you know this, he sent a picture. Bracken sent a picture of himself and Chloe and Addie. Take a look. Uh, I don't quite. <laughs> You're... Well, you know, we have another little uh, surprise for you because you miss him so much. We would like you to, to say hello to somebody. Bracken's on the phone along with Chloe and Addie. Hey, Bracken. Hi. Hi. How are you doing? I'm great. How are you? Good. We're so proud of you. Thank you. Chloe has something to say to you. Did you hear that? I love you too. Aww. <laughs> now do you feel better? Oh, I do. Aww. <laughs> well, you know what? The sweetest thing was that he was just proud of you to get here. That's a good guy. You he got is a, a wonderful good guy. Wonderful man. And you're doing a great job. Ten away from a million. One more look at that category. All of them, but the first one up, Preggers, is something you know something about. I've been there. <laughs> <laughs> Four lifelines. Ready to play? I'm ready. Let's play. 30 seconds on that clock, as I said, Preggers is the category. A normal full term human pregnancy lasts about nine months or how many days? 180, 280. 380, 480. I am going to say B, 280, final answer. 
nine times 30 plus a little bit, 280 is it. Barack Obama, $4,000. Barack Obama is a two-time winner of which of these awards? Oscar, Tony, Grammy, Emmy. Um, I'd like to ask the audience. Okay, we're stopping that clock at 21 seconds. Audience, Ruth needs your help. And your keypads, vote now. Wow. 34% say Emmy, 31 Grammy, 26 Tony, 9% Oscar. Again, not great numbers. 21 seconds starting now. Well, I'm going to go for it. I'm going to say um, C, Grammy, final answer. I'm so glad you didn't agree with Emmy. It is Grammy. to both of his books and picked up two Grammys. We'll be back with more of Ruth's Smart Cookie here in just a minute. <laughs> we are back with Ruth Nagrin, our mom from California. Capital One check for $4,000. I know things are a little tight budget-wise at your home, so you're hoping to make some money, pay some bills, and maybe pick up a minivan. For you and the family. Yep. We've got a 16-year-old car that I think is due a retirement. Time to retire <laughs> the car. Eight away from a million, going for 8,000. Here are the categories once again. Are you ready to play? I'm ready. Okay, let's play. <laughs> 30 seconds on the clock. Recent TV is your category. An episode aptly titled The Passion of the Christine kicked off the second season of a sitcom starring whom? Tina Fey, Mary Louise Parka, Julia Louis Dreyfus, America Ferrera. I'm going to say C, Julia Louis Dreyfus. Final answer. We love her. You have it right. $16,000 question. In a nod to its home state of Pennsylvania, the Keystone State, what brand uses Keystone-shaped labels on its products? General Mills, Heinz, Campbell's, Nabisco. B, Heinz, final answer. Yes, it is. <laughs> Calm behind you, your sisters are woo! <laughs> They're loving this. I can hear them cat calling me. <laughs> this is for $25,000. Top secret. Not officially acknowledged until the 1990s, MI6 is the secret intelligence agency of what nation? Canada, France, Israel, United Kingdom. I'm going to ask the expert. Okay, we're going to freeze that clock at 24 seconds. Bring in our expert, Jeff Gross, with a free face-to-face -face Skype video call. Hey, Jeff. Hey, Meredith. How you doing? Uh, I am doing great. Are you ready to take a look at this question? It's for $25,000. I am. All right, I'm going to feed it to you right now. Okay. Ah, uh, it's your lucky day. It's your lucky day, Ruth. I lived in England for uh, about seven years of my life, and I know that MI6 is the secret intelligence agency of the United Kingdom. I am 100% sure. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank You're you. You're welcome. Now go win some more money. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Jeff. Jeff says 100% sure he lived there. United Kingdom, you have 24 seconds left. Time starts now. I'm going to say D, United Kingdom, final answer. For a second guess, Jeff Gross, you got it. All right, Ruth, look at you.
you going for fifty thousand dollars you still have two lifelines there phone a friend and double dip 45 seconds now on the clock questions are even harder well known to coin collectors the toven specimen is an extremely rare example of what type of coin penny quarter dime nickel I'm going to phone my friend. Stopping the clock at 39 seconds. Let's see who you have in mind standing by. And there they are. Your brother Daniel, your husband Bracken, and your best friend's husband, Joseph. Who's going to be? I think I'm going to go with my brother Dan. Your brother Dan. All right, we're going to get Daniel on the line. Hello. Hey, Daniel, it's Meredith from Millionaire. How are you? Good, how are you? I'm very good. I'm sitting here with Ruth, as you know, and she is going for $50,000. Okay. Okay, <laughs> this is where you come in now. You have 30 seconds, Ruth. Your time starts now. Okay, Dan, the Toven specimen, T-O-V-E-N, is an extremely rare example of what type of coin? Penny, quarter, dime, nickel. 20 seconds. Toven specimen, I think. Was it was penny an option? Yes. Is that what you said? Okay, I think it's an aluminum penny, but I'm not positive. How sure are you? Mm. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, <laughs> how sure are you? Yeah. 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 Thirty nine seconds, the clock starts now. Well, I trust that brother of mine, he's pretty smart, so I'm gonna say a penny, final answer. Yeah, aluminum. That's right. It is. <laughs> I'd say Ruth has a lot of pennies right about now. Go for a hundred thousand dollars. We are back with our stay-at-home mom, Ruth Mannion, who came to New York City for a little R and R, and also to sit in the hot seat. But had your family back. Home, Bracken rooting for you with the kids. He wished you the best of luck. So proud you just made it here. Your little girl whispered, I love you. You got yeah. your sisters, Sarah and Katie, behind you, cheering you on. And now your brother answers that question right. And that's a lot of pressure to be under for anybody. It is. Okay, let's pay off some more bills and have some fun along the way. Sounds great. Four away from a million dollars. Take a look at those categories. I hope you like that first one up, Sahara Desert. Are you ready to play? I'm ready. Let's play. <laughs> 45 seconds on the clock. In terms of square mileage, the Sahara Desert is closest in size to which of the following? Mediterranean Sea, United States, Mongolia, Gulf of Mexico. Um, I'd like to double dip. Okay. 30 seconds on that clock. I want to remind you that if you miss this at this point, you do go down to $25,000. Two options here, two chances. Let me have your first answer. I'm going to go with D, the Gulf of Mexico. Final, Final. answer. Not the Gulf of Mexico. 30 seconds left on that clock. We're going to start it up again now. C, Mongolia. Final answer. Not Mongolia. It was United States. <laughs> but you know you went for it. That I took a lot it. of guts. <laughs> that sound means we are out of time. It's a great way to end. $25,000 for me. more millionaire to come. Until